Hello 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 everyone. In today's video we are going to learn what noise cancellation is and the differences between passive and active noise cancellation. But that yes, before, before everything, let's, let's make clear what is external noise cancellation, especially in this case focused, for example, towards headphones. External noise cancellation is what allows us to reduce unwanted sound from the outside while enjoying the audio signal we are really interested in. Noise cancellation is divided, as I said before, into passive and active. In fact, until relatively recently we only had passive noise cancellation. Let's start by explaining passive noise cancellation and from there we will go directly to the differences with active noise cancellation. Passive noise cancellation consists of taking advantage of physical elements of a device to attenuate sound from the outside. For example, in in-ear earphones, the physical element that acts as passive cancellation and that is used to attenuate the external sound are usually interchangeable silicone gel rubbers, since they are usually adjusted to the size and shape we need, so that when coupled to our ear, they make the external noise does not penetrate or does it as little as possible. On the other hand, if we look at the case of headband headphones, it is quite clearer, since the element would be the padding that when it covers the ear completely insulates the external sound. Obviously, if they are over-ear headphones, I mean that the ear cushion covers the ear completely and stays inside the earphone housing, it will provide much more isolation than headphones with the ear cushion above the ear. In either case, with this method we are not really cancelling the noise, but we are avoiding it as much as possible, which sometimes may not be enough if, for example, we are on a train, subway, or bus. That is why the creation of active noise cancellation is so important. This technology can be identified in the devices with the acronym ANC, which stands for Active Noise Cancelling or Active Noise Cancellation. With this technology we will be able to cancel unwanted background noise through wave interference. Thanks to the integrated microphones, the system identifies the external noise and sends an identical but opposite acoustic cancellation signal, thus blocking the sound. This is also known as sound compensation. This system works independently in the left and right channel, as it is a predictive system that compensates for noise as it arrives at each microphone, right or left, and depending on the type or intensity of external noise, it will emit a type of waves or others. Simply, what it does is to create an artificial sound wave that in our ear collides with the external noise, achieving a cancellation of this, so that, for example, if we go on a train, we will hear only what interests us, while the outside noises will be blocked. But in reality, like any technology, it is not perfect. The active noise cancellation will work quite well with constant noises that are between sales and 30 decibels. If the noise has high peaks or greatly exceeds those decibels, it will not be as accurate as we would like. For example, with the engine of a train, an airplane or a car, it can work quite well because it is a constant noise, but, for example, if we are next to a construction site and there is a machine working intermittently making a lot of noise, it will not act perfectly. The same as if we have practically no ambient noise, it will not work well either, because it will send unnecessary waves and the audio may be a little weird. What I want to say is that if you are in the park listening to the birds in total silence, you don't need to set the noise cancellation on because the audio will be a bit unreal. Well, well guys, guys, so, so much for the explanation of what noise cancellation is and the difference between passive and active cancellation. As always, I hope the video has been useful and you have been able to learn a little more. If so, don't forget to leave me a like and subscribe to the channel and hit the little bell so you don't miss anything. As for me, that's all. As always, a pleasure and until the next video.